Hello guys and welcome to Lal Bazaar in Gangtok and we're speaking very loud, very slow right now and very uh, quietly because we are in a place, in the, we entered the back door of a place and now we are waiting for something very special which we have been looking for for the past couple of days but finally in the end we found it and now we're waiting for it so let's see how this is going to be <laughs> Thank you. So, this is Songba, guys. We finally made it. And made it. Yes. We got Songba here from a very beautiful family in the Lal Bazaar. And I have to pour some hot water inside this uh, yes. bamboo straw a recipient thing, a receptacle. And I don't know how much should I fill it up. I don't know. Just pour onto it. Oh, oh, oh. That's it. Okay, that's it. Michael, your turn. Okay. Let me move the camera so you guys can see it better. Okay, now it's better. This is the tsongba served in bamboo. Tsongba. Professionally made here. I have no idea what we're trying. Oh, yours looks better. Oh wow. Okay, let me put some more for you. Okay, thank you. I think I'm. It's, no, it's yours full. is full. Mine is full. <laughs> After three days of searching for it in Darjeeling. Wait, five minutes. Yeah. Don't. Oh, wait. Don't. This way. Oh, okay. Five minutes. Five minutes. <laughs> okay. So, we wait five minutes for the songba to finish and then we can try it yes here in a back room room <laughs> yes with a tibetan flag on the wall from a nice tibetan lady and even though today it's supposed to be dry day so it's not available for today she was like nah, okay come on i will give you one that's so sweet yes Hmm. Okay, I think the five minutes are past, Gigi. I'm curious to try this thing. It looks like a very weird concoction. Very weird. Like the seeds have just like a little bit opened up and now we have a white juice coming yes. out of them. Put this inside. You just put it inside and you suck through it, Gigi. It's simple. It's a straw. Wait, let's do the Romanian thing. Oh, shit. Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> they come in a bamboo shape. So... I don't know. Okay. Has like a wine taste. Mmm. You feel it hard. Yeah. It's, it's it's pretty alcoholic. Right? Yeah. Like you feel it hits you. Like having like a little bit of balinka or like a rakie or something. It's similar to the rice wine from uh, South Korea. Yes. It's similar to the rice wine, but this one feels more strong a little bit. Yeah, it has it a kick. It has a it has a kick punch. And it doesn't have like the soft taste. This one no, is no. like... Oh. <laughs> yeah, it's in your face. It's like... Whoosh. Oh, shit. If I drink all of this, I'm gonna get drunk. Considering the fact that we didn't eat today, let's see if we get drunk or not we on this thing. We just had breakfast because we were running the whole day. Yes, today was a busy day. We went all over the place. Guys, if you want to check out what we did today, check out our previous vlogs from a couple of days before. We're gonna link them up somewhere here, there, up there. Yes. It's very interesting. Definitely. I and would now, definitely recommend it. Yes, I we're trying it for the first time. Hey. Uh, the straw here has like this sealed end just for the little things not to come inside. Mm -hmm. Smart. Very smart. Very smart. Very, very cool. You yeah. give the people of uh, Tibet and of Nepal a bamboo pot and some things to put inside, you add hot water and you have a wonderful time. Thank you. <laughs> Thank, Thank you. you. It's very good. Thank you so much. It's Thank first you so much. time we're trying this. Yes, Thank it's you. first time. So much. Thank you. Thank you so much. <laughs> To teach it. <sighs> yes, this was the nice lady who allowed us to sit in the back room and just have a sip of Tongba and relax after our long day. 
Actually, and unwind. today it was a dry day, and this drink wasn't actually allowed. Yes. But we were like, it is for me, <laughs> Yes, Gigi made the puppy eyes, and well, now it's not forbidden anymore. So we but were it's lucky. Like we're drinking by ourselves here in this room. That's okay. Yes, it's only the two of us and the wonderful flag of Tibet on the wall, reminding us of the time we spent there. Yes. And oh, I remember wow. there they had a canned beverage, kind of similar like a beer, it's called barley wine and it was I think 2% alcohol and I asked the people around there why is it only 2% it only alcohol and they told me do you forget where we are? We are at 5000 meters altitude, if you drink a beer here, you get fucked up. Yes, that, that, that was pretty intense. This is how this thing thinks yes. looks like. It's like a concoction of concoction of bowls and stuff i love this idea like it's, it's so cool yeah Chongba. interesting Chongba. Chongba or, Chongba. Chongba or um, Chang. Chang. Or, or there was another way of saying it the nepali way dungru 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 and tongba or chang how do you call how would you call this in romanian uh, karkalete <laughs> Yes, basically means a mixture of everything. Yes. <laughs> Mom, if you're seeing me right now drinking this stuff. Yes, this is what I'm doing. I'm drinking this karkalete for trying it out. <laughs> oh my goodness. And before I forget, there's a beauty to this drink. You have the receptacle of hot water and you can always refill your bamboo receptacle and somehow the drink magically regenerates so it's refillable so you can drink how much you want and now Gigi is trying to go full crazy on the with the straw <laughs> yes this is the sign that the tongba is working in Gigi's case stop it in our country in Romania this kind of millet seeds, out of which this tongba is made, is used as parrot food. So, I think we will go back to Romania and we will go to the pet store and we will ask, can you please give us a big sack full of parrot food? And he was like, what are you gonna do with it? I'm, like, I'm gonna make myself some tongba! And he's like, what is that? Come with me, I will show you. I learned this in, in Sikkim, yes, in no Sikkim more, in India. No more, we're gonna start basically drinking parrot food so yes that's a big improvement we should start a business for Gigi. our day and age yes we should start a business try to sell this to the romanian people let's see how they will react to this kind of thing at the beginning they're gonna be tell us that we are crazy we can call it hmm parrot food drink that was if you drink this you become a parrot and you fly away <laughs> same time and, I don't know, would you see yourself drinking this instead of beer? No. <laughs> no? No. <laughs> no. I don't know, I can see myself drinking this instead of beer. If I would have this available in my country, I would see myself drinking this without any problem. I mean, when it's hot outside, <clears throat> I, I, when it's cold, yes, maybe. Yeah, when in the cold season, perfect. Hot, when it's hot, it looks also interesting, it's like a marketing kind of thing, you know? It has a marketing spiel, yes. Yeah, true. Because I haven't seen Tongpa in, <laughs> in Europe so far. Uh, me neither. It's the thing here. It's a Tibetan thing or a Nepali thing, I don't know. Kind of a, a boat, a bit of boat. Mm -hmm. What do you guys think? Would you try this? Yes. Let us know in the comments. Let us know if in the comments if you want to try this. It's something else. And uh, it's... It was available everywhere. Let me try to see how the north thing is. But now it's not that available anymore. Mm. It's kind of like mustard seeds. Yes. But they're kind of like the, the consistency. The consistency of mustard seeds, but they're like a little bit sour. Yes. Interesting. Hey, nevertheless. I it love is the first time for everybody. For every time. I love the presentation. And in case you don't know how to pour the things, the hot water on top of the 
the seeds. Yes. We have like a metal. They give you a bowl, um, bowl so you thingy. don't make a mess on the table. Yeah, exactly. Romanian, no Russian. Romanian. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. you. <laughs> yes, there were some nice people like, huh, Russian, uh, Russian, they, Russian. They were a bit tipsy. Uh -uh. Yeah, there were some tipsy people. Yeah, they were a little bit tipsy. Maybe they had also oh, the forbidden yeah. tongba. No, you never know. Days of dry day, man. Don't you forget? Maybe they are friends with the lady. So <laughs> you never know. Oh man, this is strong. We should get some food. Mm -hmm. <laughs> After this, we definitely have to get some food. Yes, definitely, because I feel like like entering into my system is kind of weird. Anyway, so guys, this is Tongba. I think you're having enough of our reaction and seeing two guys white guys talking with two bamboo sticks in their hands and with a straw coming out of it so it's something special we never had any idea about this we heard from all the people you should try this when you get to Darjeeling and to the north in Sikkim and we're like mm, okay sure why not and in Darjeeling I tried all the places and it was not available. The people tell me, if you do find it in Darjeeling, don't try it because it's spiked with all sorts of insect powder and all sorts of shoe polish. And just to, to, give, just you to give you a buzz. Because people somehow are this desperate at some point. Yeah. So he told me, if you want to try it, try it in a place where you know it's good or in a rural area. And when we arrived here, I asked more people and even the nice guy, a Tibetan guy at our hotel, he told us go there, go to Lal Bazaar and ask around where do you have Tongba? and they will tell you, they will point you to a way because it always moves so it's not only in this place, it moves sometimes it's available in this place, sometimes it's available really? in a different place yes, it's okay. not always at the same time, at the same place so yes we were lucky because we find that even today is a special day and technically you're not allowed to supposed to have it but we got lucky yes we did we got lucky and grateful for that yes forgot to try this before leaving north perfect perfect way in, way to end this video and to end this series of videos from sikkim with oh. a nice cup of tsongba and a nice companion <laughs> <laughs> next to me with a nice company here we're drinking this, this. Oh, yes. yes okay thank you guys for watching this has been a short one but i hope an interesting one for you because for us it was definitely an interesting one it was our first time trying this so see you guys in the next one bye 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 don't forget share subscribe blah, 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 subscribe subscribe subscribe, subscribe. Oh, like, like button like button hit 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 someone will be angry bye <laughs>